Guys, so many of y'all asked for the red beans and rice from New Orleans. So I'm about to bring it to you and show you. If you hear from TikTok, let me know in the comments, guys. I appreciate y'all. We're on our way to 150,000 followers. With that being said, I've been having the red beans using one pound of red kidney beans, y'all. I've been having them soaking for about three hours. Okay, so the very first part of some New Orleans beans, to get it started, you need to take the pound of beans, put it in your pot, put it in the water, and let them soak for about a good two or three hours. So now we're gonna go ahead on and drain the water out of the pot, and we're gonna refill it up with some fresh water, and then we're gonna get to the seasonings. That's the fun part. All right, let's go. Okay, like I said, guys, I've been having these soaking for a good three hours, okay? So that's where we're at, check it out. Okay, now just go ahead and do a quick little rinse. Okay, so now we have our beans. We get the water filling it back up again. We're gonna get to about a half a pot of water. And then, like I said, I'm gonna show you all the seasonings and we're gonna go through that. Before you know it, y'all gonna know how to make some delicious New Orleans red beans. And we're gonna try this hot plate out, guys. I like to use this because I'm right here in front of y'all. We're gonna go through all these seasonings with my back ain't turned and all that. Simplest way to do it. So let's go. Okay, so we got the pot on the heat, y'all. We got the beans in there, we got the water. Now it's time to start getting some seasoning in. All right, go ahead and put your heat on medium. We're gonna do a, tea, a tablespoon of your Cajun seasoning, guys. Two tablespoons of uh, parsley. Two tablespoons of garlic powder. We need these to taste right, y'all. We ain't got time to be playing around. We need them to have some good flavor. A tablespoon of your, your Cajun seasonings. That's some black pepper, y'all. That's to taste, okay? Put in how much pepper you want. Remember, you can always add more, guys. No big deal to it, okay? Same thing with the salt. It's to taste. Remember, you can always add it in after. Don't get carried away now. And you're gonna add three whole bay leaves, okay? Go on with that. All right, guys, go ahead and take a look inside this pot now. See, we done added all of them seasonings, okay? So what we're gonna do now is give it a good mix, and we need to give this a good while to cook down, okay? We got a lot more stuff we're gonna add to, into it, but for now, let's just let it cook like this for the next hour and soak in all these good seasonings, okay? On a medium heat, remember that, it's a medium heat. Okay, so the beans been cooking about an hour and a half. At this point, we need to cut up a whole onion and one green bell pepper, and then we'll throw that in the pot next, guys. So let's just go ahead and dice it on that. So just go ahead on and continue to go ahead and dice up your whole onion. And then we're gonna do the bell pepper. Now we're gonna need to go ahead and cut up one whole pound of smoked sausage. It's already pre-cooked. Just go ahead and cut your sausage in a little bite-sized chunks, y'all. The whole pound. All right, guys, we're also going to need two tablespoons of minced garlic. Let's go. Now go ahead and add two tablespoons of butter to your skillet. Now throw in the whole diced up green bell pepper, as well as your whole onion. And let's go ahead on and stir this up, guys. Get a good saute on it. And then at the very, towards the end, we'll go ahead and add in that minced garlic. We don't want to burn it. All right, guys, we're back to add the two tablespoons of minced garlic. We're gonna go ahead on and add that. Then, we're gonna go ahead on and mix it all up, guys. Get that all nice and stirred up. Smelling good now. All right, guys, now we go ahead and add this right on into your beans and rice, okay? Scrape all that off in there. And we're gonna use the same skillet to do the sausage now. But we need to go ahead on and give these beans y'all a nice good mix. Get all them seasonings nice and mixed in there. Take a cup of them beans right now and go ahead and mush them up. And this is the trick to getting your beans with a great consistency and a little bit thicker like we want it. So go ahead and mush up one cup. Now go ahead on and take that bean paste we made, put it back into our bean jar and give it a good stir around. It's going to thicken right on up for us. All right, guys. So now the red beans and rice are done. Take a look at it. This is true New Orleans beans and rice. It's absolutely delicious. You're gonna enjoy about three or four bowls probably. 
All right, guys, we got a lot more of these dishes coming from New Orleans. Go ahead and like and comment and subscribe. And don't forget to hit that bell notification so you can get all my future videos. Thank you.